Hello everybody and welcome or welcome back to Cobalt Core, the fresh new roguelike deck builder that I'm very excited to be back to here today. We're going to be going in on hardest mode, which I can only assume is the hardest mode, but maybe we'll beat it and we'll unlock harderest. We'll see. I don't know. Uh, we're also going to be going in with Max, the new character, which will give us a full crew of non-original members to potentially unlock this if we win, which sounds very fun. Going in with the Ares as well. We've used the Artemis twice. Let's use the Ares a second time here. It's kind of wild. We'll go over what hardest mode does as we get in. Core OS corruption must reroute power. Please select boot option. So this is one of the things from hardest mode. We have to pick a downside of our choice. Lose a... Uh, wait, gain a debris? It's a garbage card, but we can remove it. It doesn't say non-removable. Lose a max shield. I'll go with the debris. I, I can... I can go for that. Gain three max hull, common artifact, upgrade two random cards to type B. Let's do it. I didn't even see what this one was in the first place. Let's uh, go take a look. Computer snooze. I, hey, I'm not an alarm clock. Does anyone have the admin password to the ship computer? My name is Kat. You should remember, you created me. Oh, yeah. Uh, also, uh, where am I? Time loop. Ah, and why do I have fingerless gloves? That's right. I'm a cool hacker guy. Well, all right. So let me check my deck here. We have reroll B. So reroll is reverse your hand. Reverse the order of the cards in your hand and then gain two temp shield. Okay. So we got an upgrade that gives us to shuffle your hand, randomize the order of the cards in your hand, and then gain two shield, which does last between turns. Admin deploy, play your leftmost card for free and then exhaust it. Huh. And we upgraded EMP Slug to this, which generates two heat and does two more damage. I mean, it's good, but yikes. All right, so here's what we're going to do. Put on the shield. We'll shuffle our hand. Not that that really matters. We'll go blast. Blast. Do we get out of the way or do we just toggle the cannon and take one damage? Because this ship is a little bit weird. We have a cannon here and a cannon here. We can switch which one is out and ready to attack. Uh, the one that's not out actually gains armor. So I'm just going to take one damage there. It seems not too big of a deal. Going to apply a status effect to itself. Going to raise their shields. Which one do they want to get rid of? Play your leftmost card for free and then exhaust it. Truthfully? No, I was going to say this is garbage, but it's not more garbage than that, which is literally just garbage. Uh, another big thing to keep in mind for this difficulty is that our cockpit is brittle, meaning that if this row takes damage, or column takes damage, it's doubled. Doubled pretty big deal so i'm gonna throw out this just to block it for me seems like a uh, a why not moment could have got rid of the debris but i think the shield will be nice and useful we're probably gonna be just um more or less dunzo though let's reroll. <laughs> this is, i don't know surely admin deploy will become useful but it's not right now Come on, give me my... Thank you. Thank you. Nice and clean. Shift shot. Do a damage and move the enemy two to the left. Launch a boulder. Move... Move in a direction equal to the amount of heat you have. Is what that is. Shift shot is interesting. I'm gonna give it a shot. A shift shot. Ooh... I do want to remove, but I think I have to go for the double elite. Are these the enemies? These are the enemies. Okay. I'll get the extra movement instead here. All right, what do we got here? Does two damage a shot. I'm not drawing any freaking... 
Oh my... Oh my god. Hmm. It's a little awkward. Does this... Well, it doesn't really matter. Would that work if I played that? Does it exhaust the next thing? Okay, so whatever's in the front, it does just auto blast, so that's helpful. We'll toggle. We'll go for a little shot here so you stop getting so much shielding. And then we will... This is what, one damage? I'm going to take the one damage. I want to save my movement. We want to dodge when we're going to dodge more than that, you know? Two to the left actually is so perfect because it'll make it so this blasts him here. Um... Then we get the hell out, right? Or do we... Once again, I think we take one damage. I think that's fine. I think saving movement for when the, uh... Incoming smacking is going to be a little bit more. What's solar wind? I didn't even notice. That. Rock factory. Launch an asteroid at the start of every turn. Sure. Let's go for the event. Anyone else getting a really bad headache? No, it's from the high-pitched static. What is that? Ah, you all again. Hello. Which of you shall I teach this time? Let's obtain one of two of Max's cards. What? <laughs> Draw ten cards, but get two less next turn? Escape artist. Draw a card, discard a card, shuffle your hand, and then immediately after, play the leftmost and rightmost card in your hand. Move left slash right to... What? Draw a card, discard a card, shuffle your hand, then play the leftmost slash rightmost card in your hand, move left slash right two, and lose at the end of your turn. I'll tell you what. Sure. I know Kung Fu. Oh my god. You do not. Oh. <laughs> I'm good at this. Okay. You got that, uh, the brittle... The brittle in the middle. Can't really do much about the brittle in the middle, though, right now. I've not once wanted to use admin deploy. Like, the obvious use for it is playing, like, a big card. I'm feeling a rock factory. Bonk. It's okay. It, it's just too much damage to pass up, for obvious reasons. Uh, uh but, 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 but. toggle, blast you and move you. Sure, I'll get the attack drone out. Not that it should really matter. Oh, I'm gonna kill the attack drone though, aren't I? Yeah, that's so weird. Okay, a little bit of a two damage smacking. Gotcha. Gotcha. I understand everything now. I, I just, I misread it. It's a complicated card. Not because it's like, oh, it's so tricky. But like, it is, it's just slightly more messy to learn about than the other stuff. Uh, if I move that over, too, I actually shoot myself in the cockpit. So, I don't want to do that. Bye-bye. Alright. Gain a drone shift in three pebbles. Not right now. Move drone to the right. And draw a card. Okay. 
that actually seems really good for uh, the Meteors. First attack each turn pierces, going through shields and armor. Every time your discard pile is shuffled back in your draw pile, the enemy loses a hull. Hmm. Sure. I could see that being useful. Hey, uh, give me your uh, money or uh, gold? Is this your first stick-up? Yes. <laughs> Get that rock factory a brewing. The brittle. I just want to get that out of here. Not super helpful. Whenever, immediately after you play the leftmost or rightmost card in your hand, move left or right to, depending, I'm assuming, on the... Gotcha. So I'll move right to if I do that. If I do this, I'll move left to. Hey! So, does this move me? Yeah. Oh, oh, God. This, this is going to be tricky. That's, that's interesting. It's going to be tricky to utilize it properly. Get rid of that buff. Or the temp shields. Let's get rid of the buff. I'm going to get the corrupted core. We do one hull damage to them after a certain amount of time, too. So that's helpful. So they'll take the hit for us. Hip hip hooray. Yeah, we, we gotta we gotta figure out how to handle the weirdness. Excess heat. If heat is three or more at the end of the turn, overheat take a hull damage. Yep, 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 yep. That makes sense. Ow. On draw, immediately attack. For one damage. Huh? Did that not just work? Okay, that helps already. We could move this over. Over, it can get two damage on. Sounds good. Oh boy. Toggle cannon. We should be good with the basic shot. That was messy. Outgoing. The status will be applied to the enemy wherever they are. Power drive and total stun. They do one more damage, but they. Oh god. Rightmost card gains retain for the end of the combat, gains recycle. Goes to the top of your draw pile instead of your discard pile when played. What the hell? What the hell? That could be game breaking for sure. The but it has to be the rightmost card. Firewall is tricky. Make them powerful and then but stun everything. Oh lord, these are these are weird. I'll get in rage. Seems scary. Gain a temp shield every time an asteroid is destroyed. That seems so useful for us. All right, we got through uh, the demon belt there. Draw a card every time you miss a shot. Eh, we'll see. Hey, I have this extra scaffold lying around. I think it'll look great right in the middle of your ship. Also, it's a great tax write-off. Sure. We'll see. So they can... They shoot right through it. Looks uh, better, I guess. No refunds. I honestly, I think this ship looks better with it than the first ship did. Hmm. I will say this immediately sucks.
I don't know if I want to give them a, a huge power up for the whole fight already. This hand is so bad. Do this, I move to the right of blast, but then I die. So we have to move to the right. Blast them. It's just... Cool. Cool. This is gonna go well. This is gonna go so well. Basic dodge. Some shields. Sure. Still haven't found a strong... Oh, no. That's... That's no good. Right, we have two movement. So we can get out of here. Do I want to take two damage to my shield and save one movement? I think we have to do that just in case they are in a spot where they can completely blast my hull. Um, escape artists. Draw a card, discard a card. Getting the attack drone sounds really nice. Of course, should have done it first. Should have done it first. Should have done it first. That's a lot of trash. Um... Chibo. Chibi Robo. Um... At the start of every turn. I mean, it's not going to help us right now. The best I can do is not die here. But it's close. Starting with three health is... Um, I don't know if you've been able to piece it together. Starting with three health... Uh, sucks. Breaking the asteroid gives temp shield. I'd rather... Oh, God, I shouldn't do it, though. There's another shield out. I mean, what am I going to do with that? I can't even do shift shot. Wait, can I? Yes, I can, because they also move too. But also, why would I do that instead of the other one? Because this protects my cockpit at the very least. All right, we should be fine. Yikes. I don't really want to put out the attack drone because then it just dies. I, I... <laughs> okay. There goes the asteroid. We should be completely... We're Yeah, we're completely defended now. If I do this, I die. <laughs> if, I, if, I, if I EMP slug, I, I actually die. Okay, so we're, we're, we've got a little bit going on. Bonk, bonk, bonk. That's actually kind of perfect. Put out yet another asteroid. Move you two to the left? Probably. Got through it, man. It's no joke. You are dead now. We should be fine regardless, but I don't even want to chance it. I don't want to chance that that does overheat damage to me. Draw a card. Retain. Exhaust. Weird. Spacer. Huh. Another solar breeze. I don't mind that. Hey, bud. Yo, can I get you anything? Fight me. What? I mean, what's the likelihood that I can fight this boss without doing this? Well, that oh, kind of sucks, though. I really want to remove... The debris so bad. It's a tough one. That's a tough one. Yeah, 
Yikes. I just... I don't want to be at one. I can't, man. Big crystal. Immediate, um, yikes. First and foremost. That puts you in a better spot, and then we can just save that. Take the one damage. Ouch. If we move to the right one, we're already fine. Getting the rock factory going is going to be very handy. Already safe. This is going down, which sucks. I could save it. But I think that makes no sense right now. It's all good. And we, we we wanted to move to the side anyways for the asteroid reasons. Okay. I don't think I want to play escape artist right now. And I don't even want to bother trying to figure out if I should move you <laughs> or if it would ruin me. Unfortunately, I can't really... I mean, I could EMP slug... And it's fine. That's a for sure. If I take double damage. Oh. <sighs> this would be if I just wanted to move. We need to make a move. Okay, so if I move to the left, I can take one damage. Right now, I'm taking two damage. Oh, I can't move. Never mind. I'm taking two damage. That's fine. And then I'm taking the whole damage. It's painful, but I also want to make sure we get a move on, right? Like, we can't just let it fly the whole time. Move you two to the left. Is that that good for me? Yeah, it is. The attack drone saves me from that damage. If we miss, we draw a card. Which, sure. It does a damage and it saves me from a damage, so it's kind of like a temp shield. But I had the temp shield anyway, so in other words, like, why would it really matter? We're completely safe here. But we're also doing completely nothing. Let's prep. Take turn to prep some defense. Move that asteroid. Move that asteroid. Heat sink is... Very awkward here. Moving to the left feels really good. Take one damage. Doesn't really bother me. Oof. 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 God, a lot of our starting cards just feel like they need to go. I could just move this. I could parallel shift. Toggle cannon. Don't toggle cannon. <laughs> Don't toggle cannon. I thought the other one was on. Alright. New plan, then. It's getting broken anyways. We're taking one damage to the shield. Alright, that's fine. If 
I leave that there, then I'm fine. If I draw another one, we have a little issue. Right now, we're only taking one damage, so who cares? Solar Breeze, I don't know what I'm drawing per se, so I don't really want to risk it. Escape Artist, I kind of want to just get it out of my deck. It's fine. Completely fine. This is a lot better than it seems. This seems really bad, but it's uh, not. We're taking two damage. And that's going to be going to the shields. God, slow going for sure. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Kind of want to sow the breeze. Because we can always just move it right back. I think for the love of God, I like, I'm going to be here all day if I don't get some of this action done here. So I'm going to be overheating. I need more ways to reduce my overheat. Oh, for the love of God. Holy crap. Yeah, we need, the deck needs help. So we basically got fully healed, nearly. Attack damage equals your missing hull. Attack for two damage if killed. We've seen these. Another rock factor? That makes no sense. We'll launch one, and then we'll break the other one. The only way it could make sense is if we had three rock factories, because then hip hip hooray, I gain a temp shield for every asteroid. I gain one temp shield a turn. It's not worth it. Uh... Let's see. Launch an asteroid. Yeah, I mean, sure. Salvage arm. Gain energy every time you destroy a mid-row object. That's definitely useful. Warp prep. Three shields, three evade at the same at the beginning of the turn. That seems super helpful. Gain one of two common artifacts, then one of two common artifacts, then one of two common artifacts. Add three Genesis canisters. But play and playing it removes it completely from your deck. Um, this actually is possibly the only time I can use admin deploy like super effectively. No, because it exhausts it. No, it plays it and it exhausts it. Okay, yeah, I think this is actually the rare time where we can use it. Two evade on the first turn. Temp shield equals your missing hull. Let's do that. The Every fifth time you attack, gain an evade. I don't attack enough. All enemy cockpit start with weak, so they take one more damage from attack. I think I need it. I need evades bad. Three drone shift on the first turn, so we can move stuff. Every four Isaac cards played, gain a bubble. The next object you launch will have a bubble shield. I, I think I like the drone shift. Us being able to like manipulate where they get, you know, the asteroids go better. Sounds great. Good God, I am in danger, though. This deck is nothing yet. Boom. It's beautiful. Immediate yikes. Start blasting. We're two heat. Get this sucker out of here. We're almost done with all of our Ge uh, Genesis canisters already. Uh, 
is so weird. Could have done something with heat sink instead. Could have been good. Those are missing anyways. I might as well. Okay. So that does work. I was curious. I just want them gone at this point. Oh my. I mean, I can protect myself from that for sure. Uh, that's a problem if I play that, unfortunately. Unless... It's so not a problem. Because I can just go like that. All right, EMP slug, we do overheat if we do it. So, that sucks. There, there's all of our Genesis canisters gone, so that, that helps. They're gone forever. God, he's getting so much stronger. Corrupt the core gone. Good God, good God. Come on, we need some tempo. We need some tempo so bad, man. Give me the heat removal, man. Give me the heat removal. I need to get over there so that he's drawn over there. I don't really want to... There's a big reason why they're all that far over there is because it's Solar Breeze, you know. It makes sense. Uh, if I'm moving... Sure. Parallel shift? Why? I don't know. I don't know, man. Come on, move all the way over. Thank you. You're at least taking a little bit of damage. Huh. Huh. <laughs> if I get hit by this stuff, I am in hell. <laughs> well, if I try and play a drone here, it does just kill it, by the way. If you don't know the answer to that. There we go. Finally. God. I need damage, man. Gain an energy and a heat. No. If fired on, will completely move out of the way to the right. Decrease by one every time it triggers. Goes away at the start of the turn. That seems really good. Attack for three damage. Add a static noise to your draw pile. Well, in hand, all cards exhaust. What the hell? Attack for three damage. Add static noise to your draw pile. That makes it zero. Four damage. I really need ways to do damage. It's pretty bad right now. So I'm going to say yes. I'm taking it. I have to go up to the path to remove stuff. Well, men, prepare for battle. Wait, I have a question. Your sword. Who crafted such masterwork? Where'd you get it? The sword factory. The duel guy again. Let's just choose weak point and be done with it. I'm not offering a duel today, jerk. Okay. All righty. Swap that. If he's not offering a duel, I'm not, a, you know, not going to worry about it. So he's currently doing a whopping Nerthen. Should go straight through. Good. Take one damage. Attack drone. We could shuffle. Don't really care about the other thing. I mean, he, he should move in the way of the attack drone, more or less. I could go one, two, three. I could literally move it three spaces so it does one more damage, but I'd rather have the ability to shuffle everything. Hmm. 
How much does this do? That does three damage. Yeah, I kind of thought so. Uh... I guess. That won't even do damage unless I move over. So the breeze, that helps. I mean, eh. Second one's a bit silly there. Play your leftmost card, gain exhaust. Uh, come on. I, I need to get damage, man. I need to get damage in there. I'm just going to get rid of that. I I'm, I'm know it could be useful, but it's just also kind of strange. If I move left two, I'm in a pretty good spot. I'm overheat, though, if I... Oh, boy. Just move here as well, and we can kill the guy. There we go. Do one piercing attack and reduce your heat by three sounds like a yes to me. It's an exhaust, obviously. That's something. You just Cleo. Can I get you anything? Fight me. I don't want to fight you. I have to remove this debris. I have to. It's just... It's too much. We need to trim down the deck a bit. Right, we move to the left one. We're fine already. I do love the hole in my ship. It's weirdly helpful. Move two left. I don't think I want you to move two left. I think I want to go here. God, if I move you two left, what happens? He goes here and here. I guess that's more or less the same thing. If I just swap. Take one damage that gets blocked. Asteroid just completely busted that up. Exothermic release. Not helpful. Not helpful. I kind of want to do damage, though. It's just one. Pop out another meteor there. Okay, so we at least get to do something now. This does three damage. We can't let that fly, of course. Curious. I can move over. I could obviously EMP slug this and we'd be fine. Or I could move over to... I'm fine with taking a little bit of damage because for the love of God, we need to get momentum. It's criminal. That's just too good of a move there. In that basic dodge, we can toggle our cannon, so we only take the one. We are getting there. We're getting there. Methodically. Slowly. Methodically. Okay. Perfect. Should have solar breezed instead. I'm going to regret this. Oh, I can't, man. I can't. Does it matter if I move to the left? Kind of, yeah. Kind of a lot, yeah. Unless I... Whoop. Oh, but what does that really do for me? I guess we would do it in... If we did it in the opposite order, we would have gotten one more damage out. Which... How much of a difference that would make, it's hard to say. While in hand, all cards exhaust... I 
don't mind... I don't mind some of this getting exhaust. Solar Breeze exhausts anyways. If I heat sink this and this, we just move everything over except for that. That works, I think, right? Kind of. Kind of. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm good with all this stuff exhausting. Taking one. It's fine. Wait, I took a... Oh, that's right. It does two damage. Oh, my lord. Let a guy freaking do damage. We move one there so we don't blow up this so we can actually get a little bit more damage out. Never mind. Yeah, you're... Go away. Go away! Ventilator. Discard a card. Draw two cards. Minus one heat. Does not discard when played. Interesting. I think that that's actually really good for what we have going right now. It's not damage, though, I will say. That, that much is not lost on me. Okay. Enrage is a no-go. Heat sink is irrelevant. This is a lot of missiles. It's a lot of effort for that, huh? I don't know. Three damage. I need I need to get going. I could have moved to take nothing there, but I just felt right to me. Oh, shoot. I thought that, that wasn't discarded when it was... Oh, no, the upgrade makes it so it's not discarded when it... Wait, what? Oh, it has exhaust because of uh, admin deploy? No. That was the thing that got discarded. That was There's just a lot going on there. Okay, if I do this, I move into the danger. Huh. Huh. I don't really want to move into the danger. Thank you, though. Let's trim down the deck. I could... Do a little bit of something, something, but I'll take the one damage and trim down things a little bit. Uh-oh. That, that exhausts anyways, right? Oh, that was Solar Breeze. So the answer is no. It do not. Exothermic release does anyways. Two damage. Not much of a reason. Let's dodge out of the way too much. I think we maybe take the smack him. I'd have to use two dodge to prevent one hull damage. Well, here's the thing. It gets me out of the way of the missiles anyways. Because those do spawn right there. So... I'm going to lose my mind. Two damage, one. Same deal. Let's just get out of the way. We're not... We don't have the asteroid card right now. We should be able to heat blast like a son of its own, so... Okay. Good. There's ventilator. Ventilator. 
That hits me no matter what. Oh my god. It's not good. It's not good at all. This is four damage. If I stay here, I take four damage from that. Ventilator makes not a lot of sense right now. I feel like reroll is fine. This is okay. Could have been much worse. All right, thank God. Get out of my swamp. All right, let's trim this down. Come on now. No. It's good, but no. Uh, beams an energy at its target once per turn. That's so good, but I just need to grab some damage, man. If you end your turn with more than zero energy, gain a shield. It's something. Hey, bud. Yo, can I get you anything? The same thing, like, removing some other garbage is the same as kind of gaining a little bit of damage, in a way. So we could think of it that way. We could also upgrade. I can't upgrade that in a meaningful way. Ventilator. Turning into a minus two heat is pretty appealing. Drawing four cards that also cycles through my deck quicker. I don't mind that. Can't make exothermic release non-exhaust, right? Correct. I can turn it into a three damage card. It's a one-time use, so I don't think that that's really the answer. Yep. I think we can make this into something. We can get there. Back for more. Hello. Uh, currently, you're doing nothing. Do I really use two, two movement just to do a memory leak? Uh, it's not really just for memory leak, I guess. We can also... Bing, bang. Boom. That works not... That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Uh, lol? God, this is awkward, though. Huh. I don't really want to spend a whole one on that, though. Yeah, it's a mistake. I'm getting that out of my deck for now. It's not that it's bad, I just don't... It's not really what I'm needing at this time. Cool. I don't want the... Uh, I, wanna, I don't want the status effect. I'm pretty sure it's a uh, an energy downgrade. Which I don't think I can really uh, handle right now. One hand, all cards exhaust. I mean, that's fine. Most of the stuff does anyways. Probably should have played Admin Deploy just to get it out of there. It's two... I dig it. I'll take... I'll happily take one at this point. Because it should... Yeah, it goes straight down. Uh, awkward. Awkward. <laughs> it's 
slow down, man. Slow down, man. That's not what you wanted to do. We'll toggle just in case that works. Because I, I forgot that... That was in there. Don't really want to exhaust this. I don't really want to enrage either, do I? I I'm shocked at how little use uh, from enrage I've been getting. Did that, okay, yeah, that only did one. Interesting. Interesting. Thing. Bang. Boom. Get out of my room. You know, return an exhausted card you can't do. I get to choose? It's choose one from your exhaust. That's pretty cool. I'm going to go with this for now. That is pretty cool. Back to try and steal some artifacts from me again, are we? Sorry, it won't happen again. Can I get you anything? I don't really want to fight. The attack drone A is really appealing. And we have not done it yet, so let's try it. Two damage a turn. So we can just, like, manipulate... We have a lot of really good um, spatial manipulation. All right, if I move you two to the left, what the hell happens? Uh, uh, nothing good. We get Rock Factory growing. It could be bad. It could be good. We're taking one damage, but it's going to hit our shield. All right, Rock Factory, thank you. Get rid of the corp. wanted to be able to draw the other card there. Reroll, I'll get another shield. Sure. There's a lot going on in this, but it's actually completely acceptable. Which is crazy. I also feel like I'm properly drawing cards here. Which is so nice. I feel like I finally got my deck into a slightly better spot. I'm going to break that, which is an unfortunate thing, but not that unfortunate. Should have waited a second. Absolutely should have waited a second. Because we could have just not wasted that movement, basically, is the whole reason why. Yeah, it sucks. That's the area where that can be pretty bad. Um, if I move one to the left, if I move them two to the left, what happens? It's actually pretty good for me. It's not great, but it's pretty good for me. Do I want sh shift shot to exhaust? Doesn't it already? Literally just move the enemy around me instead. That's pretty fun. I don't need to dodge. I'll just make the enemy move. That's pretty fun. Uh, this actually isn't as scary as it seems. I think I'm actually going to just burn for four damage there. Take the whopping double damage to my cockpit, which is two. Oh, <laughs> Uh, exothermic release sounds really appealing. I have two movement left on these. I don't really want to... Huh. Huh. I could move this, but I don't... Well, this is gonna break anyways. That's two damage, takes one less damage from all attacks. I don't really need to heat sink, and I definitely don't need to enrage.
We're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. Uh, I think it's not worth the tiny little bit of damage. Take the one, clean that out, so we can get the two damage going a turn now. Should be helpful. Blocked already. Uh, get wrecked. That's nice. <laughs> Getting that. That's a two birds, one scone situation. Um, boy. It's fine. I'm taking two damage and then the one damage. It's not great. It's not great. That is, though. All right. The fact that we're able to make it through proves that this is, like, absolutely a game where you can just skill your way through it, which is so nice. For the rest of combat, all exhausted single-use cards cost zero energy. Uh. Just requires me to have four mana, though. Which is not very likely this obviously could be broken I could see it being broken but okay I, I I have I have it in my mind permanently replace your cockpit with an empty scaffolding but lose ma half your max hull huh huh I think that's probably fine Gain energy every time you destroy a mineral object. That does obviously solve the problem. Warp Master is obviously very good. Let's do it. What could go wrong? Eh. But we can't take double damage to a nothing. So that's pretty good. Yeah, that seems wacky. I like it. See, the, the reason I thought this might be good without the extra energy is... Because of one admin deploy. That's the hope, basically. That's the entire hope. This better not hit me. Somehow. Okay. I'd have been mad. Um, I just wanted to do damage. Well, then I shouldn't have done that because it's irrelevant. <laughs> two movement to block two hit. I actually, I think the answer is maybe yes, actually. It's pretty spooky right now. Love it. Should work fine. Heat sink mostly, just for the actual heat removal. Ay ay ay. Gotta get some damage a brewing, man. What could go wrong? What could go wrong? Well, in hand, all cards exhaust. You know? Sure, to that one. Huh. a little bit weird a little bit weird there letting those exhaust but i kind of think i'm fine with it some momentum exothermic release feels really nice
That I love. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> oh well. Just gotta slow it down just a little bit sometimes. There's no guarantee we'll be fine here. Loving these. So they have like a... No, no, no. I was going to say they have a last... No, it's because the the asteroids, which causes some severe problems from time to time. Things in the middle getting destroyed obviously could be quite useful in the situation, but oh well. Is it worth the heat... Is it worth a movement for the heat sink, basically? Because I'd have to... Yeah, it is. Ew, I know what I just did. There, we'll do that. God, because otherwise the freaking... Yep, asteroid. There we go. Basic shots. Toggle. We're good to do it. Do we move them? No, why would we? We get to do the nice clean two damage there, and we only break a an asteroid for it. Oh no. Uh do I take so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do I do enough damage? I do. Okay. Whew. It would have been fine anyways. Another attack drone sounds kind of nice. An attack and then gain autopilot is very curious. I can't I can't have another attack drone, I don't think. Because, like, I'm running out of ways to place them all down anyways, and they half the time they get blown up by my freaking uh, asteroids anyways, because it's hard to really figure that out. Reroute is very interesting, but also very messy. Getting a weird signal. Offering from another timeline. Another has sent aid. Oh god, I don't remember. I don't remember their thing. Uh, your defense. Perry is... Riggs is drawing? And stuff? I mean, that could be good. Drawing and movement? Oh, we can skip. Instantly move, move four spaces in a random direction. That could go bad. I think I'm going to skip. My terminal is sending commands I didn't input. They seem useful, though. Addy! Hi! Can I get you anything? I'm not... I can't. I can't fight. We'll do that. We'll do it. We have plenty of time. We have plenty of time to fight. Rock Factory also launches two asteroids is something. Shift shot two and two. I do want to do more damage. Enrage also gains an energy is interesting. Choose a card in your hand and play it for free is way more appealing. That could get me to play the uh, the big four boy. I don't know. Maybe we hit an event. I'm actually been I've been really into the events. Uh oh. Uh oh. Faulty jump point. We're way too close to a black hole. That's bad. If we don't jettison something right now, we're in serious trouble. Lose half your hull too. Oh. You know, I could lose heat sink since ventilator is probably the better of them. Parallel shift. Parallel shift could go too. No, no, I think we... Eh, this is tricky actually. I'll do that. 
What if that's why my drones feel... What if this is what my drones feel like? Now is that the time to get existential. Let's keep going. Hello, Brack. I'm not going to exothermic release right now for no reason. Interesting. A little bit odd. Um, shoot. I don't really want to move five in order to attack, do I? Do I? It's going to overheat. Oh, no. Wait. Wait, what? Astronomical activity. You and the enemy both generate a heat at the start of your turn. Oh, my God. That sucks big time. It has to be hull damage, too. It had to be hull damage, too. You don't seem to be doing damage, so... Like, directly. So, turning off your spawns for a turn seems nice. This might make me take less damage from you, but... Yeah, this is... The fact that that's direct hull damage is... Ow, it's pain. Oh, look at that! He did turn on his guns. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, <laughs> okay. We got ventilator. Okay. I don't really want to do that. So, I'm going to move. And I guess just move these with me. Yeah, that's fine. Wish we could keep ventilator. Oh, my lord. When I have such low heat to begin with, or low, low raw health to begin with, it's so bad. Um, it's probably fine if I take one damage and save my movement for a scarier situation. This also, this works really well for this. It stops whatever the hell is coming out there. Oops. You smelly son of a so-and-so. Uh, uh, perfect. Don't really want a rock cannon here, unfortunately. Turning that on, so we only take the one damage. He's overheating. Good deal. Good God. Uh. Choose a card in your hand and play it for free. Exothermic release, that helps. Don't really need to play anything for free right now. Doesn't necessarily do anything for us. RIP to this guy, but I just thought it made sense right now. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, too tight. Too tight for comfort. Another EMP slug. Okay. Okay. You know what? Sure. And this one does not have the extra upgrade. Gain extra energy on the first turn. Oh my god. If we get that uh, that one card immediately. The four mana card immediately. Wouldn't mind it. This is attack three times. It's, 
attack for one three times. Doesn't really matter. I'll just I'll gain the shield for not spending it. Okay. I'm gonna lose my mind. I gotta slow down, dude. All right, um, we're mostly fine here. Go for a little bit of a boop, followed by a boop. Shoot right through the middle, but so does this guy. I think it's worth it. We got more damage out. Uh, this is workable. Very workable. I don't know the... Do I rock factory? Just get that out of here. Just can't play the cleaning exhaust style, so don't know that it's necessarily going to be that helpful anywho. gonna hurt if we get hit by it. Don't have any movement of any kind. Uh, in a weird, we could do like a do a memory leak EMP slug. Like literally kill my own attack drone and then go for it. Well, I think we have to, because otherwise we're taking the five damage anyway. No, we don't have to. We can just toggle cannon. Yeah, I think this is just... Um... Eh? Didn't really... <laughs> it didn't really work the way I thought, because we played a card before it. All right, all right, all right, all right. Alrighty. There's so much so much to juggle. And this one's this run's been going on much longer than the others. I feel like a ventilator, probably. Let's get the, the breeze, just because it's basically a car drum. We can see what else we got here. In rage, I don't particularly care. All cards exhaust. Ventilator costs man. Uh, yes, that's right. We gotta remember that. Okay, um. I need to get movement. Should be fine. We're prepping. Heat sink is just not proving to be uh, exceptionally reliable for us here. Huh. Gotta get something going here. Otherwise, this fight will be 12 years. We got 7 damage coming in. That's certainly something. I think what we'll do is we'll hit you with a shift into don't do that. It's damage. It's happening. Here's a card in your hand. Play it for free. I mean, I can't, <laughs> can't shoot the guy. So... This it's either here or here. I guess I'll yeah. miss to draw a card. I don't really want to miss to draw a card here. Okay. He just keeps on going.
I blast you two to the left, go one, two. So let's think about what we're doing. I don't really want to take the extra hit. It's fine. Shift shot, we could have got one damage out. I don't want to. I didn't want to overheat there, but at some point we're gonna just have to say, okay, I guess we just overheat because this is getting ridiculous. This is getting gosh darn ridiculous. That's so funny to me. I'm happy to take a hit here so that we can finally do something. Should we? No, we should not enrage. We die if we enrage, because then these do two damage. We literally can't enrage. How much is this adding? Two shields. The big unfortunate thing. Let's see. Give me, give me a card draw. An attack drone. You know what? Getting an attack drone out sounds so nice. And yet, how can I even do it? I have to move to the side. I mean, I kind of want to move to the side anyway, so we'll go for an attack. Get the attack drone out. It doesn't do anything this turn. And, it, and it, then it dies. It's just, we have such a messy deck. Everything is just so disynergistic in such an extreme way. And this guy is a tank lord. In an even more extreme way. EMP slug. I can't really move where I need to. Without, because I can, well, I guess I could go. If I'm willing to take a smacking, nope, never mind. I don't have the energy for this. Why would I assume I have the energy for this? I'm gonna lose my freaking mind here, man. Why would I ever have the energy for it? You kidding me? It's not even a reason to play anything. Nothing does anything. Try and cycle through our cards faster. Oh, finally. I just wanted to I just wanted to finally do it. Doesn't even really matter here if I play the attack drone, it's just gonna blow up. I can't uh, toggle anything, I can't move. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. We've done it. We can, we've done it. We can do something to them. Bonk. That's a hit. That's a hit. I don't know. Sure. Okay. Well, in hand, all cards exhaust. So all cards are free. Let's get rid of the basic block. I'm going to get rid of the reroll. These are all free right now. We'll play that. Solar Breeze to draw something else. Uh, sure. Sure. It dies, we get a temp shield, maybe? Cool. Alright. Nothing happens there. This is just such a... It's such a slap fest. Because we're just fine here. Like, none of this stuff causing a problem for us. I don't want to. I, I guess I could. I'm, I'm just killing him by shuffling my deck enough. Is basically what's happening. Shouldn't have drawn. We're, we're getting there. We're getting there. I don't really want to flip them. One hand, all cards exhaust. We could. But I think that that causes a problem for us more than anything. 
we literally just have to Okay. One of these days this fight will be over. One of these days. He's taking damage. My movement is just That's my movement is the problem. Uh, give me something else. Oh, no. No! Alright. This could be it. So if I do this... Explosive slug. We can obviously swap the cannons. Swap the cannons, move to the left. We're fine. I just can't I just can't heat sink. The piercing damage super helpful there. <laughs> oh my god. I think we just ventilator a bunch. I think we just I think our best bet here is to just cycle through our deck faster. Okay. Choose a card in hand to play for free. Is there anything that I care about? Not really. I could turn off his shield generation, but that gives him that extra power, which, yeah, we know that that could give us a disaster. We'll get the movement. Oh my god, I mean, could I... Perhaps... I have one movement, never mind. I have I have one choice that I can really do, and it's this. As much as I have all these cool cards that I'd like to play, I can't switch this cannon on. Because I will die from that. Slowly but surely. have to do that first. Now we ventilator. We're just trying to do direct damage. Literally just trying to do direct damage to the hole by shuffling my deck. I'm alive. Oh, baby. Wait, could I... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. J just, just would you? Would you just? If I move you to the left, we go one, two. If I'm yeah, if I shoot you and I move you to the left. It's in these two columns. We could move to the right. We could do the attack drone. But then the attack drone just dies immediately. I can't. I don't want to really overheat because I feel like I've just been doing so much for this. I think that the answer is that we literally just freaking do one toggle. Oh, we didn't even have to toggle. Oh my god, piercing damage. Oh my god, piercing damage. Watch me die after this. No, okay. I'm free. And you know what's stupid? I didn't take damage there. It just took forever. <laughs> uh, shuffle your hand and do it two damage. Sounds great. I, like... Really? Really? Okay, I think we, um... I was gonna say I think we do the release, but I mean I think the answer is still that we do do the release, do do. Okay, that'll work. Oh, you're the junk, 
the Junkman. Don't really want to. Do I want enrage? No, not this early. I've, I've, <sighs> com, com jam unplayable. Oh, oh no, we are gonna die. Like, we are, we are gonna die. Don't want to move. Here comes the heat. Because here's the thing. We're going to get heat doing automatic damage to us. And we can't do anything about it. Unless we happen to draw our heat removal. Well, here's the good news. I'm taking damage anyways. So we can go for the full-on attack. Like, you don't take more damage by having more overheat. So, that's the good news. The bad news is, this situation just, just sucks. <laughs> I can't really get out of this fine. Um, if I move you two to the left, that's super ideal. You can solar breeze it. I think we can memory leak. Solar breeze it. Uh, ventilator just for the reduction. Ooh. No, that's just going to die. Do I get rid of the basic shot? No, why would I? Okay. Thank God I have some kind of heat reduction in my deck. Otherwise, oof. want to EMP blast that. Uh, the Enrage is tempting now. I think I actually do it. I'm scared, but mostly I want to be dodging all of these anyways. Okay. Memory leak. Basic dodge. Solar breeze. That all works for me. Okay, potential another... Okay, ventilator, thank God. Um, okay. That's what I had hoped. Unfortunately, yeah, we can't um, get back over there, per se. Unplayable. I guess I'll take my shield and smile. We are going to win this, right? Yeah. Of course. pop them. Alright, so now we move one, drone one, move one. Got him. Right? Yes. Yikes, man. Uh, EMG, I can't take another EMP slug. Spacer, I say no. Small boulder, I say no. The fact that I'm alive, man. Meowdy, not in front of everyone, please. Can I get you anything? Repair two hull. Two hull, or make my deck less bad. Which has taken so much effort. Uh, two hull, I mean, I only have... It's, God, I just... I hate it. That's never what you want to do. That's how you know you're losing. <laughs> Time check, four milliseconds. Hell yeah. Yeah. All righty. So, 
That helps. It's a good start. Solar Breeze, we might as well play it. Why not? Get the card draw. Enrage. Stupid. Obviously, I didn't want that to happen, but hey. Okay, this is a whopping one damage that I'm taking. So that's pretty cool. Um, I want this to work. I'm willing to take the one to do a little bit of damage. Because we could also uh, turn this off if we hit it. Piercing damage. Sure. A little bit of overheat. A little spooky. Two damage. I'm going to try my best to keep the attack drone alive. But like, oh god. It wants to die, man. I don't know what to tell you. It wants to die. I just, I'd have to, yeah, I'd have to move two to save it, and then I, it's, it's, I just, uh, uh, it had to. It had to just throw itself right in there, huh? God, the double hole in the middle is so nice. If I move everything to the right, I get another asteroid. And then I'll just generate the shield for not playing another card, I guess. I'm taking one damage. Generate the shield because I had an extra energy business. Can I add a garbage card to my deck? I feel like I'd rather turn that off. We have Ventilator. Good deal. God, this fight is going so much better. Cope. The fact that we have only two slots that can be hit is kind of the big thing here. And look at what I'm doing it with. I'm doing it with these... These whopping cards. Look at that. Go for the trash. Get that out of there. Uh, we're going to stop whatever this is. I'm assuming it's... Oh, no. It's just a standard missile. Um... Um... It's... Yeah, it's fine. Toggle the cannon. We take nothing. We're doing a, barely any damage, I'm aware. I, if I could move this over. We could do one more damage to the big boy. I don't think that really makes sense here. We'd be doing it for the card draw. But this way, we, we can also think of it like us. Uh, if we save the one energy, then we gain a shield. So it's like we're playing the one mana, one shield card, which is not a great card, but it's a card that I would play in that situation. Probably shouldn't have done that, actually. It's all fine junk to the deck being added here. I mean, that's... Oh, it's pretty appealing. What's the other option? I, I move the left one, then I take one damage to the other. I mean, that's a pretty good option. The other option, I could just move everything over. And that's not bad at all. Obviously, I don't really have a whole lot to do with this. What if I kill this man with just shuffling alone?
shift shot. One, two. Eh. Exothermic release. Attack drone. Huh. Kind of like this into attack drone. I'm going to save the exothermic release. Just getting a little bit more sustainable damage is very appealing, even though it's going to get exploded. I have one movement still. That overheats me. God, I wish we didn't get the B upgrade for that. I really wish we didn't get the B upgrade for it. No damage taken. I still... This is hitless still. As much as it looks like it's a mess, and as much as it... is a mess, <laughs> it's hitless. I can't imagine that it's gonna be for like a long time. Curious. This is a one damage situation. I could move it over, move myself over. Could have got a memory leak in there, I suppose, but that might cause some issues right now because we still haven't gotten the stars to align and for us to be able to uh, do this. Exothermic release. I don't hate it. Escape artist is a little bit weird. I don't hate it, but I also don't. I want to draw a card. Eh, not that one. Let's do some damage. I don't really want to play exothermic until I'm using it to actually. Ooh. How much movement I got? I got a couple. If I do this, I'm moving two to the right. Oh, boy. I want to be able to play a freaking card, man. So... I think it's fine. Even though I know, I know. But it's too damage. It's too damage. This, this is super disenergistic if you ever want to run guns and actually have them, you know, doing shooting things crazy as it may be so move one to the right I kind of want to move left toggle EMP EMP this is already fine like I, I already don't care so I'm going to say that's a sign to, to do this this is one damage and it's not even because it's Hitting my shield, my temp shield. Okay, here we go. Thank God these are free. That's super nice. Okay. EMP slug. You know. Shoot. <laughs> Let's do it. We can we can finish this off. We can finish this off. We're not far off of it. Oh, you you did it. You went and you did it. You went right in my face. What a mistake, my man. I feel like I can get rid of that.
This is a little bit of a slightly weirder situation, I guess. I could enrage him. I need. Let's see what the. What, okay. All right. We've done it. We've done it. Jesus, man. Let me guess. Hardest difficulty. There's something else after it. You're growing stronger. Who shall it be this time? Uh, we'll go for Drake. Going down the line. You can see our entire time streams, right? I see all. So you know that I'm not a good person. Why save me? Your fate is tied to the others. Oh, I get it. You're so far above our plane of existence, you don't even understand good and evil. That's so lame. You misunderstand. I already tried to discard your time stream into the void. I'm unable to. Damn, all right. All right, so we just need unseen memories one. Oh, that was... Oh, okay. That wasn't even the memory. Yeah, what's so special about it? Sounds like just another derelict. No, this one's different. The sensor readings are off the charts, literally. What sensors? What charts? I don't know. I stole the sensor array from a science vessel. I have no idea how to use it. Ah, right. But the lights are going crazy. There's something special about it for sure. All right, I'll snoop around and see what's going on out there. T minus 34 days. Hello. Brimford. You just the regular? Nah, I'm cutting back. Just a quadruple espresso. You're going soft. Watch it, old man. You don't come here when you need something. What is it? There's a big ship loitering around the nebula 20 parsecs from here. Yeah, what about it? You know about it? Yeah, it's an unregistered craft with experimental propulsion system. I don't know exactly what, but it sounds like a lucrative target. How do you know all that? Some possum girl is in here blabbing about it. She runs deliveries to and from it. Rigs. Well, bada bing, bada boom. What a chunky run. We got the Gemini unlocked here. Of two minds. I do wonder... This crewmate will invite herself aboard eventually. Don't worry about it. And then this is question marks. My guess right now, if I were to take a shot in the dark, would be fighting the shopkeeper. But there's two unlockable characters we don't know anything about. Gemini. After you play a card, toggle both your active cannon and your missile bay. Oh. Whenever you play a card, it goes whoop, 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 whoop. Oh. Oh, God. It does not have the uh, minus one card draw penalty, though. But it also does not have a um, the shielding. And it's also a five wide. But it also also has much more health than the ship we played today. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Well, so we only need six more different artifacts to unlock this ship right here get six so it's like incentive to you know pick up new artifacts uh win 10 runs to unlock this i mean we're well on our way holy crap though i'm gonna end that one that was a long freaking run i hope they're not usually that long and they probably will not be because that deck it had a it needed a lot of help and i think the big reason why is not getting as much removal early as we would have wanted trying to experiment with the new max cards a little bit too much for a little bit that we like we got a bunch of cards that were very like specific use cases and then those use cases just rarely came up i will say in the final fight uh it was worth keeping and upgrading the card that was like play the card and then exhaust it upgrading it into play any card for free that ended up working very well because we were able to discard all of our trash cards for completely free no price at all which is really helpful um but yeah i don't know it's kind of funny it, it shows I think this is a really good mark of a good strategy game, though. Like, we had a rough situation. However, we did... We were able to outplay a f fine deck. Like, a deck that had some things going for it, but not enough going for it. Uh, we were able to outplay it and win on the hardest difficulty anyways. Which, yeah, let me tell you, it was no small, like, feat of effort. It, I had to try. Uh, I made a lot of misplays, and I'm, I'm aware of that. I, I call them out in the moment. Uh, it happens. I really do. If I were to pick one thing to improve about the game, I don't want to. I don't need a full like combat redo or anything like that. I really wish there was an undo the last move I made button. That is all I want. Just undo the one last thing I did. 
because it's so often that you do something and then you it's so immediately clear to you that you're like oh shoot and it's kind of like that wild frost thing where it's like i don't want it to be i don't want it to be easier i don't want it to be easier but i do want to be able to just say ah shoot i know what i did i literally just did it and i am you know i recognize it two seconds later that's my only thing right now and other than that it's honestly it's perfect game i really like it i like it a lot uh that's it thank you for watching check the channel rogue support every single day and i will see you next time hopefully they will not all be this long Bye bye